<laughs> okay guys here we go okay you should have gone through your complete getting started setup by now it's been a couple days um, wherever long it takes sometimes it takes people a little bit longer than others but all this here you should have gone through and everything on your page now should be green okay now that you understand everything you've got your domain name set up we're gonna go ahead and this is this video is for people that already have uh, companies that have a website all right for people that already have a website this is what this video is for okay next your next step what you want to do is you want to come up here to capture leads and you want to drop down to the lead capture pages slide over drop down to floating capture form this is the form that's going to show up on your website that's going to capture your prospects uh, customers information when they visit your website this is going to how how we going to help you build a list to market to Let's click on the floating capture form you're going to come over here now yours is not going to hardly show nothing of anything at all this is all the forms that i've created but anyhow it's going to come to this page that says floating capture forms we are going to create a new floating capture form and let me show you what a capture form looks like um, let me show you this one here this is what the capture form looks like um, basically it's got some information up here it's got of course our share button that they can share your videos with everybody on the internet and let you know where they are where you are information with a video um, and that's basically what it is now this video here does not have the survey form but we'll get to that and I'll show you how that works next okay so now back to where we were we want to create you a new floating capture form now first thing you want to have done is you want to make a video of yourself um, as the business owner people want to identify and like to do business with people they know and trust and what better way to do that is to look at your face and talk to them and they are going to be more uh, apt to put their name and information in when they know they're dealing with the owner or the general manager of that business so you need to make a quick video with a flip camera or any video and upload it to YouTube uh, if you don't know how to do that uh, like I say there is a there is a, a, a play video up here where it's a instructional video and if you need any help you can always uh, get a hold of me and I can show you how you can get that always uploaded to YouTube once you've got that up there then we're gonna go back and create this floating capture form just click on create new floating capture form we want to add a new floating capture form click on go enter the name of the right here of the floating capture form you're creating because you could have more than one if you like you could have one on two different websites on every page on your website we don't care anyhow you want we're gonna make this one test number one okay we want to show the survey and down here this is your first name and your email address is mandatory and that's all I recommend you ask for anything more than that you could ask for a phone number or whatever but anything more than that and, and likely people aren't going to give you that information so you want the least amount available and those are the least amount available just so you can market to them there is no at this time there is no autosponder campaign that you want to send you can always create one later if you want but right now there's nothing and this is the instant sales system sales site this is where you want people to go if they want to click on a, a portion that I'll show you it says what this on your site um, and that's what you want to have in there okay there's a drop down menu but basically you want instant sales system sales site where people can go if they click on the small button on your uh, uh, floating capture form this is additional you don't have to worry about uh, leave this alone leave this on no the only thing I recommend is down here on the height change that to 600 leave the width alone and then save your changes to the floating capture form now here's your floating capture form what it can look like right here on the right hand side each one of these sections a b c d is labeled where that information goes now you can play with this if you like and this is the survey and you can put anything in here you want but the more all we're trying to do is capture their information don't forget and get them back onto your website so they can pick out the menu or select whatever you're selling whatever business you're in we want to get them back to your website we don't want to hold them too long so what I, I'm gonna make a quick one here if it was me I'm gonna everything if I don't want anything in that side I'm just gonna highlight it and I'm gonna blow it out 
and I'm just going to highlight it and hit it back up. Now right here in the body text, that's going to go right in here. I'm going to do this. I'm going to call this uh, Mike's Local Pizza Parlor. Okay? Now, I can take this and I can play games with it. I'm going to change what the text looks like. I'm going to come in here and I'm going to change the size. I'm going to change that to maybe like about a 36. Yeah, that'll fit. Then I'm going to go in here and I'm going to change the color to red. Now I'm also going to, I should have come off of that first, highlight it, and I'm going to center it. And that's all I'm going to say. Oops. Yeah, I don't know how you spell parlor, but anyway, that's close enough. Um, the PS, I'm going to blow off. I don't need anything on there. You can put something in here and build this thing all you want, as fancy as you want. doesn't matter. I'm going to do it fast, and I want to do it plain. Save the changes. Move to the next step. Now, here's where you can put no video if you want, and then only that little here's Mike's deal, which is ridiculous. Nothing's going to be there. Or you want to select a video from another website, which is YouTube. Okay? So, what I've already done is I've, I've clicked that button and I said save it. Now I want to go to YouTube. So I've already got something. I, here's my YouTube. I just opened this up up here. And this is a YouTube um, video. And I'll back off and show you. I'll clear it out here. Let's just go in here and pick. Uh, let's take this one. We're just going to pick on it. I don't know what it is. And then I'm going to pause it because I don't need to see it. Right here is share. Click on the share button. Here's an embed code click on embed and then this part here use the old embed code this is going to be blue okay so you right click copy go back over oops sorry to here paste it right click paste start my video automatically so it automatically starts when it shows up and then save your changes okay now where do we want this when they put their name and information in where do we want them to go once they've done that we want them to go to your website okay so we're going to click on other website and I'm going to pretend that this is your website so I'm going to go up here and I'm going to copy your website link I'm going to copy it I'm going to come back over here and I'm going to paste it right click and paste in here but I want to make sure I don't have two HTTPs in there okay once that's done I'm gonna save the changes go to the next step the next step is I want to take a look at what I just created so I'm gonna click here to view what I just did now don't worry about the background this is the capture form we just did and here's the video okay so we'll pause that so you can see how plain and simple if this was your picture of your video up here you're going to be talking about your pizza parlor. They're going to put their name, their email address, and enter the, this code. And when they click Instant Access, guess where it's going to go? Right to your website. Okay? Now, do they have to put their name and information here? No. They can close it by clicking this button right here. Right over here, want this on your website. This, If they click this, this is going to take them to the instant sales system inside your system. And guess what? This is where they, if they like what they see, they could sign up to use the instant sales system. What benefit is that to you? Don't forget, you need three paying referrals, three people to use the system, and you can have your $29.97 a month waived. You can have your fee waived. So this is a way that will help you get people to sign up for the system. Who knows how many business people come into your parlor or to your business that are looking that could use something like this when they see it on your site. So this is a way that we help you and helps us get more people to use your site so you could have yours for free. So anyhow, when they close that, if this was your site back here, go right to your site. Of course it's not. So we've got the floating capture form set up. So that's great. Now what do we do? Okay, right here create a simulator now we're going to create this that's really going to drop down on your website and this is the fun part okay we're going to give this a title we're going to give this um, Mike's or you could name it whatever you want Mike's Pizza Parlor oops I can't spell anyhow so okay 
Now, where do we want the form to appear? We want it to go on your website. Remember, your website. And that was, this was the address of your website. Don't let's see, we'll go over here. And this is the address of your website right here. Whoops. Come on. Ah. Now what happened? Get out of there. Oh, poopies. Okay, now i got to go find Mike's website again. I blew that off of there. Sorry about that, guys. We'll go back and find out where Mike's website was. We don't need the YouTube anymore, so we'll go over here and we'll go to... Uh, what did I have? I had... Uh, uh, Pizza Hut. And this is how I find it. I'll click on it. And I went to Pizza Hut Locator, I think is what I had. There we go. Okay. So this is your website. We're pretending. So we're going to copy what your website is. We're going to come over here. We're going to put that website down in there. So that's what, because that's where we want this floating capture form to show up on your website. So basically here, we're going to go to Mike's. Put in, because that's the unique address we want to send people to. And we're going to go to the test one, which was the floating capture form that we created. Then we're going to create this simulator. Okay. And now I will blow this off. So the only thing up here now is nothing but my back end admin. Here is the site that you want to add. Now this is, this is what you want to advertise to get people to come to your website now. So this would have been your domain name. Okay. Your, whatever your domain name was. And you can, this is Mike's, your domain name, or could it just be your plain domain name? Anyhow, they click on this link, and bingo, that's your floating capture form. Just fell down on top of your website. They're going to put their information in here if they want, and when they click on Get Instant Access, this is going to go away, and your website is going to be right there behind it. If they don't want to put their information in, they just click here and it goes away and no harm, no foul. But also, if they like what they see, guess what? They can share this with their friends on Facebook or Twitter that are local in the area, um, especially if you're telling them they can get specialized discounts by becoming a preferred customer. So that's an additional way that we can help you drive traffic by people broadcasting that out to their friends. So I'll close this out, but basically there's your website. We didn't do any harm, no damage. And that's how we get people to come to your website by offering them something, either a discount or a information packet, or you're giving them something either free or what is ever valuable that you figure they need and they want it, they're gonna give you their name and information. You've just increased your sales. And that's all there is to it. The next time I'm going to show you how to come in, if you don't have a website, how easy it is to create a, a, uh, a capture form in our back office um, that'll work just like your own website. So you don't have to have a website. Okay? So that's it for now. I hope I didn't confuse you too much. Uh, I'll try and make another video on the next part of the business here um, within the next couple days. All right? Y'all have a great day and be blessed. Talk to you later. Bye bye.